Hey YouTube, Mindless MacMan here, and this is a beginner's tutorial for a MacBook Pro. I'm going to show you how to change the desktop background on your computer, change the screen saver, change the language, and work with your dock down here. So if you want to change the desktop background, first you go to System Preferences, Desktop and Screen Saver, Desktop, and you have the um, a bunch of built-in backgrounds that that Apple gives you. To change it, you just click a picture, the picture that you like, and it shows up. Like so. If you have a bunch of um, if you have folders with your own pictures that you want to make your background, you press the plus. It goes to your desktop. So I'm going to choose the um which one? I'll choose the besties one. And all my photos get put into here. If I want to change it, like that. Or, and so then I'll just want to change it back now. For screensaver, you click screensaver. And you have a bunch of different options here. You have flurry, which is like this. Arabesque, I can't pronounce that which is just a bunch of like circles that are glowing word of the day which is obviously the word of the day and or you can choose your own album so like floating that's the setting and then you can choose your album now, like, I chose camp photos and it comes up like that origami so okay so that's changing your desktop background and screen save when you want to change the language, um, you go to System Preferences, Language and Text, and here are all your, the different languages that you can change. So there's Hebrew, Chinese, Japanese, Italian, English, French, all the main languages around the world. So I speak French too, but English is my first language. So the language that you want your computer to be set to is always at the top. I speak French, so I'll move it, if I want to change it to French, I move French to the top, and now it's been changed. So if you exit system preferences, go back to system preferences, you can see that everything has been changed to French. If you want to change it back to English, or to another language, you just do the exact same thing. Move the language that you want up to the top, and it's been changed. And it, yeah, and it's been changed. Okay, so if you want to use your dock, like if for your dock, you go press dock, Dock. Now my dock is on size large. When you move slide it up and down, the size of the dock gets bigger and smaller. I personally like my dock quite big because I, I have eyesight, I have eyesight problems, and I can't really see properly. Magnification, you can turn it on, which it does this. You can make that max. This is a maximum. This is about medium. And this is minimum, which is pretty much nothing. Uh, yeah, I don't have mag. I don't like magnification on because it just like annoys me. You can also have your dock on the bottom, which it is now, on the left, here, and the right. I just like it at the bottom because it won't interfere with any of my documents or anything. You could also hide the dock which is just it sinks in under your screen so like you can't really see it but I don't like it I don't like it on hide hide on hide off hide on hide off hide on hide off uh, so yeah that's how you change your settings on your dock yeah so thanks for watching S subscribe mindless MacBook out